could be the most dangerous intersections in Kansas City. Today, police released the areas you're most likely to be in a crash, and they listed the top 10 high crash locations for the first quarter of 2018. Here is the map. As you can see, it has actually changed slightly from last year. These are the intersections from that time period. But new at 10 o'clock, as 41 Action News reporter Ariel Rothfield explains, police say the location may not be the problem, Ariel. Well, Mike, it's no surprise the area with the most amount of crashes is right be here behind me where 435 meets I-70. There is a lot of rush hour traffic as well as traffic from both Kaufman and Arrowhead Stadium. So we wanted to take a closer look at the other areas on the list. You know, Paul Redman is always on the go. What I do for a living, I'm all over Kansas City. And that includes driving through 435 and Warnell. This intersection, one of the hot spots for crashes in the city. Ranking number seven on the Kansas City Police Department's high crash list the first quarter of the year. They're just speeding in and out and in and out. The reason? KCPD says drivers are not paying attention, rear-ending other cars. One reason Redmond likes to steer clear during certain hours of the day. I don't care about the traffic, the bumper to bumper, that doesn't bother me, but it's the people that are idiots driving on that highway. Another spot for accidents, 435 in Holmes which Jacob Brownback drives almost every day. I guess it's not surprising uh, by any means because of how tricky it is. Here, crashes have gotten worse and is now the area with the second most accidents in the city. The lane ends, um, so it does make it, the, the traffic is, is jammed up and, and it does cause a lot of confusion and you don't know what the other cars are doing. Which is why these drivers have the same advice. Take it easy and just slow down. So if you want to see what other locations, what other intersections made the list, head over to our website, KSHB.com. Reporting live in Kansas City, Ariel Rothfield, 41 Action News.